The class teacher has made the worksheet given here with details of teachers teaching class 5. She has asked Mahavish Anwar to make the following changes in the worksheet. Delete the details of Deena Ali as she has left the school. Insert a row after row 4 and insert the details as Social Science Izhan Salman 35 10. Insert a column after column B to specify the teacher's gender. Change the row height of row 1 to 20 points. Change the column width of all the columns to 18 points. First we have to create this worksheet in Excel 2013. For this, open a blank worksheet in Excel and type the given data. Now since the worksheet is complete, let's start making the desired changes in it. First, to delete details of Dina Ali. Select row 5 and click on its row heading. Then, click the Home tab and select the drop-down menu arrow of the Delete button in the Cells group. Click on Delete Sheet Rows. This will delete row 5 and the rows below will be shifted up. Now to insert a row after row 4, first select row 5 by clicking its row heading and then right click and select insert from the context menu. The row you have selected is now shifted down and a new row is inserted. You can now type the data as social science in subject column, Izhan Salman in teacher's name column, 35 in age column and 10 in teaching experience column. Next, to insert a column after column B, select column C by clicking the column heading and then right-click column C and select Insert from the context menu. Now you will see that the selected column is shifted to the right and a new column is inserted. Type the desired data as Gender for the column heading F in row 2, M in row 3, F in row 4, M in row 5 and M in row 6. Now to change the row height of row 1 to 20 points, first select row 1 by clicking its row heading and then click on Format in the Cells group. The Row Height dialog box appears. Here type 20 and click on OK. The height of row 1 has changed to 20 points. Before we move on, let's answer this question. The default row height in Excel 2013 is 20. Finally, to change the column width of all the columns to 18, select the range A1 to E6 and click on Format in the Cells group. Now select Column Width. In the dialog box that appears, type 18 and click OK. Your worksheet is ready.